Tiffany Trump celebrates the holidays early with her mother Martha Maples before jetting off with her father to join the rest of the family at a very heavily guarded March a Lago. Tiffany Trump celebrated Christmas with her mother, Martha Maples, a few days early before she jetting off to Florida to spend the holiday with her dad and half-siblings. The 24-year-old first daughter and her father, President Trump, arrived at the Palm Beach International Airport at 1.30 in the afternoon as they made their to his March a Lago estate where they are spending the Christmas holiday together. Tiffany was photographed arriving at Marche Lago with a Secret Service agent in tow, and she quickly changed out of her white dress and put on a short, black romper to walk around the grounds and soak up the sun. But before heading south for her holiday vacation, Tiffany spent some quality time opening gifts with her mother in New York City. Marlet, 54, took to Instagram on Friday to share a photo of herself posed on the floor of her living room with her only child. In the picture, they are surrounded by presents, and the mother-daughter duo appear to be wearing matching cream sweaters and black leggings. Marla is holding a box from the luggage company to meet, and there are holiday bags filled with presents sitting between them. Sweet and cozy pre-Christmas moments with my girl, the mom captioned the image. On Friday afternoon, Trump's only child with Marlo, his second ex-wife, was photographed following her father off of Air Force One after they arrived in Palm Beach. The law student at Georgetown University finished her first semester of graduate school last week, and she looked ready for some fun in the sun in a white dress and dark sunglasses. She carried a pink handbag and was seen sitting inside a black SUV at the airport while waiting for her father in the 80-degree weather. While Tiffany was in sitting in the back seat of the vehicle, Trump shook hands with members of the crowd on the tarmac as they cheered and chanted, USA! USA! Earlier in the day, President Trump signed his tax cut bill on Friday morning in the Oval Office in front of a handful of reporters instead of at a lavish White House ceremony, in his final order of business before the start of his Christmas holiday away from the White House. When Tiffany arrived at the estate, she was seen walking across the club's lawn before changing into a black romper to go on a stroll with one of her Secret Service agents. March a Lago is being heavily guarded by Secret Service agents, snipers, and the U.S. Coast Guard while the Trumps are in town. Tiffany's half-brother Eric Trump and his wife, Clara, arrived at the lavish Palm Beach estate on Wednesday along with their three-month-old son Luke, their two dogs, and their security team. The pair appeared cool and casual as they sported tees and shorts while strolling across the club's green. First Lady Melania and her son Baron were said to have arrived at the family's winter White House on Tuesday ahead of the holidays. Clara was later photographed speaking with a Secret Service agent on Friday afternoon, wearing a loose-fitting tank top, casual shorts, and a wide brim hat. Meanwhile, Donald Trump Jr. took to Instagram stories on Friday to share a photo of his eldest son, Donald Trump by I, I bundled up in the blue fleece and overalls while posing in front of a tractor. He later shared the video of the youngster driving the tractor in North Carolina. It's unclear if he and his wife, Vanessa, will be taking their five children to March a Lago for Christmas. It's also unclear if Ivanka Trump and her husband, Gerald Kushner, will be flying to Florida with their three children Arabella, Joseph, and Theodore to join the family for the holidays. Ivanka converted to Judaism to marry Jared, and the family celebrated Kanaka at their home in Washington, D.C. this week. The two senior advisors were spotted arriving back at their home after a day of work at the White House on Wednesday evening, the last day of Kanaka. Earlier in the week, Tiffany enjoyed dinner with her mom in New York at Atlantic Grill near Lincoln Center. Although they had an early Christmas, Marla will certainly be missing her little girl over the holidays. This month, the nostalgic mom shared a few throwback photos of Tiffany enjoying the holidays as a child including a picture of Marlo and her daughter sporting matching red turtlenecks while riding one one of the little girl's toys. She also paid tribute to her late mother with heartwarming photo of herself holding Tiffany while she and her mom, Anne, sat on Santa's lap. Marla was married to Trump from 1993 to 1999, and she tagged her ex-husband's March a Lago estate when posting the picture, which was taken when Tiffany was a toddler. Last year, Trump's youngest daughter spent Christmas Eve and Christmas with her mother in her home state of Georgia before heading to March a Lago with her boyfriend Ross Mechanic for Trump's New Year's Eve. It's unclear if Ross will be joining Tiffany for the holidays.
as the two haven't been photographed together since they traveled to Europe over the summer. The couple, who previously touted their relationship on their Instagram pages, hasn't posted any images of themselves together since they parted ways in July. While Tiffany spent the rest of the summer gearing up to start law school in Washington, D.C., Ross started working as a data engineer in New York at Cotter, the real estate startup co-founded by Tiffany's brother-in-law, Jared. Three months ago the registered Democrat changed his public Instagram page to private after having gone several months without being seen in public with his other half. However, it is unclear if his decision to change the status of his account was motivated by a change in his relationship status or a desire to have more privacy while dealing with the fame and scrutiny that comes with dating the president's youngest daughter.